Hey guys, so I just want to make this quick video and give you a review about the Boogie Board Blackboard. Uh, it's an LCD writing device. Uh, it comes at a really low price point, about $50 or less. Uh, but since I'm doing this 18 month journey of trying to generate a million dollar income, you know, I have tons of things to do, huge to-do lists, I have to sketch out a lot of stuff, a lot of diagrams. And to be honest, I was feeling a little guilty about using so much paper. You know, I like to do everything digital, but at first I sketch things out on paper. So this was a really good option for me. Uh, so I've been using it for a few days now and just wanted to give you my insight on it. So first off, the build quality is pretty decent. Uh, I mean, it still feels kind of like cheap plastic, but it feels sturdy enough that if you drop it, you don't think it's going to break or anything like that. Uh, I used some boogie boards in the past, and one of the complaints was that it was a little hard to see when you wrote on it. So let me just kind of show you a sample on here. Um, when you write, you can see that it is a lot more visible. So that's pretty cool. Uh, also, it comes with different panels that you could put in the back which is a little weird to put in, but as you can see, we have a slot that has almost like a thick cardboard paper that we can put. So essentially the actual device itself has nothing behind it, which makes it kind of cool because actually you can put some documents behind here and take some notes on top of it. So that's a cool feature. But as you can see, I can flip this around. I can put it inside. And now I have a lined version. So you can see the writing. It's pretty visible on here. And it comes with a few different options. So it came with a blank sheet. It came with a dotted sheet. I guess that'll be kind of like a piece of graph paper. And the standard line sheet and also a to-do list. Uh, it, if you can see in the video that you know this is a lot clearer than it is after you put it through the screen. So it's a little hard to see the lines in the front, but it's pretty visible as far as the writing that you do on top of it. Uh, the erase feature works pretty easy. You know, unfortunately, just like the other boogie boards, this doesn't save. So what you have to do is maybe take a photo of it. There's actually an app for Apple devices that you could take a picture of it and it'll save what you have written on the screen. But you just push this to clear it. Now, one of the complaints I have is there's actually a erase feature, but it's a it doesn't really work that well. So, for instance, if I wanted to erase this, there's actually an eraser on the back of the pen. Uh, that's one another thing to note that the pen is a lot better quality than just the stylus that used to come with the older devices. But if I want to erase, I push this button and watch what happens on the screen it actually lightens. So the longer I hold it, the more it lightens. So it's almost like it erased the whole thing. But if I use the eraser, I can actually try to erase just that one section. So if you could kind of see it, it did do the erase job, but it made everything a little bit lighter. Now, in the instructions, they say that you can kind of change the way you use the erase button to get different effects, but no matter what I try, if I really tap it really fast and try to do it a little lighter like this, you see it, it can create a smudge effect, but if I hold it down and do that, no matter what, it kind of lightens everything. So I try not to use a eraser too much because I fear of losing everything on the page, if that makes sense. One other cool feature that it has actually is a lock feature. So now you can write and you can lock. So now if you accidentally push this button, it's not going to erase everything. So that's a cool feature. So overall, this is a pretty handy device if you want to not use so much paper. Uh, and especially since we now have the new feature of being able to place something underneath. I can grab something just to show you how that would work. So we have this Rolex catalog and I can show you what we can do. We can say, hey, we need to replace this with a new watch. We need to fix the logo. We could take notes actually on top of some sort of print. 
Um, we may use this in the future just for some presentations or something quick where we may print out uh, something like a website or a screen of an app and do some notes on it just for quick notes. I mean, of course you could do everything online, but sometimes just grabbing it and being able to write on it is a lot easier than loading up the computer, opening the app, finding a connection and things like that. So overall, the Boogie Board is a good product. Uh, it does have some quirks, but I think for the price point, it's worth it. Um, you know, if you're really a busy guy like me, then there's a lot of times that you can just pull this out, take some quick notes, take a uh, photo of it with your phone, and you're ready to go.